Hey friends, James here. Okay, this is low incline dumbbell bench. Um, it's gonna depend on your bench. This is actually probably a little more aggressive than I would consider a low, but the bench only has a few options. Uh, but probably around like 30 degrees is gonna be where you wanna be for this. Um, this might be a little higher, but hey, that's all right. So the point of going a low incline is to start getting your upper chest, your clavicular fibers a little more. Um, and of course, when you dumbbell bench, your, your whole chest gets worked, but it's just a way to bias up here a little more and then a little more front delt too. Okay, so a couple things with this, this is important, is a lot of people when they do incline bench, they go and they have a huge arch like this, but if you look kind of from here and up, what it does is just turns into a flat bench. If I arch like this, my body's flat, my upper body's flat, it's literally no different than just having a flat bench or marginally different. So you wanna make a difference and you have your back not arch, you make it as high as you can, just like this. A little natural arch is fine, but you get the point. Okay, so once you're set up here, um, you want to have your arms at like a 50 to 60 degree angle uh, in relation to your torso, so not way out here, not in here. And then it's important to keep the dumbbell aligned in your arm so it's perpendicular to the floor. A lot of people go and they go like this, and they're going to put a lot of stress in their shoulders, or they kind of go like this, and same thing. So let's keep it all nice and aligned. And then you're going to press up just like this. Give me a big stretch on the bottom. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. It's kind of what I think about. And then if you notice, again, I'm keeping my arm perpendicular, and that also helps too because a lot of people, they'll go and they won't bring their arm slightly back and kind of press up like that. They'll press more out like this. But if you notice my front delt, I'm shaking here. Because um, what's happening is if you do a front raise, right, and the weight's coming down here, and you, uh, when you press, your front delt is going to do a lot of the work. Whereas if you press more up, the pack is going to be more of the tension. So all it's saying is just go, make sure you're pressing just right above your nose is good. Just don't be stopping like this or else your front delt's going to be doing a lot more work than it needs to be. So let's go, go nose level and you'll be good. So that is low incline dumbbell bench.